Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So if it looks a little bit different, that's because my other camera that I normally use has to get fixed, and it can't get fixed until I go to Florida, which is in about two and a half weeks. So today, I want to make a video about the old wives' tales, the baby prediction. So the first one we're gonna do is we're gonna do the Chinese calendar. So I'm gonna look that up. Um, so it's based on your age, and Mila, stop it. Sorry about that noise. Um, so it's based on your date of birth and your date of conception. So I was born January 11th, 1993, and baby was conceived in May of this year. So that means it's a baby girl. So one for girl. Um, my guess, mom's guess, girl. Um, now there's another one that's the Mayan system. Um, Mayan prediction. Let me put that up. Gender. Um, let's see. Um, okay, here we go. So it's based on... This is an, it's a very similar to the Chinese calendar one, but it's like even or odd type things. If it will ever load on my phone, then we'll get to it. But it is the age of conception, which is 25, month of conception, which was May, so that's 5, so that's even and even, which is girl. So another one for girl. Um, Okay, then there's the hair. So it says that if the hair is nice and thick, then it's a boy if it's kind of dull and lifeless. I feel like it's been dull and lifeless, um, but maybe this is my hair is so damaged, so who knows. <laughs> but I'm going to say, so lifeless is girl. Um, my belly shape, it says that if it's low, it's a boy. If it's... Um, Higher, it's a girl. So actually, I feel like I'm kind of low, but that might change over time. Um, so I guess boy for that one. Um, girls are still kicking ass though. Um, so the heart rate. So it says that if it's above 140, it's a girl. If it's 140 or below, it's a boy. So it's always been above 140. Um, first time was 165, then it went 160. Um, and then it's always been in the 50s since, so that's girl. So it says if your feet are cold, then it's a boy. If your feet are like the same pre-pregnancy, then it's a girl. And my skin has been the same, so they haven't been cold. So girl. Um, if I crave sweet or salty, um, I guess sweet mostly. <laughs> um, I mean, I really want some hot Cheetos, but. I mainly want some sweets. I always want like chocolate and ice cream and <laughs> fruit and things like that. So I guess, girl, my skin. It says that like if you have a lot of acne, then it's a girl because the baby like takes away your beauty. If it's you have good skin, then it's a boy. Uh, my skin has been horrible, so that would mean girl. Morning sickness. I did not throw up a lot, but I had morning sickness. For the longest time. That's how actually how I knew that I was pregnant. That was my first sign was okay. Or second sign. <laughs> um, my first sign was uh, miss period. But second sign was the morning sickness and feeling like like I was going to throw up all the time even if I didn't throw up. So yeah, I had a horrible morning sickness. So girl, headaches. It says if you have headaches, it's going to be a boy. If you don't have headaches, it's a girl. I have had some horrible headaches, so I guess, boy. Um, so it says, boob. If your left boob is bigger than your right, then it's a girl. And if it's the right is bigger than the left, um, it's a boy. So mine is actually left bigger than right, so girl. Um, P color. Uh, it says if it's like a dull yellow, it's supposed to be a girl. Um, so
so yeah, um, it's been kind of like almost clear, but I do drink a lot of water, so I don't know. Um, so girl, okay, and then there's another one, which is the eye test. So it says, um, if you have, yeah, like you pull down both eyes, which I'll be, I'll get close to the camera. Right eye would be girl, left eye would be boy. I did this in the mirror recently, so I don't know if you can see it, but it's actually the right eye. And so, girl. Um, okay, and then there's another one. There's two more that I need to do. Um, one is the baking soda one, but I have to pee for that. <laughs> and then there's the, the ring test. So I'm going to get put a ring on a string. So let me go and get that. Okay, so I'm going to lay flat on the couch, chair, whatever, chair, couch, <laughs> um, and then put it up. It would be so much easier if Chris was here, but he's not. Okay, so I'm going to put it above, again, not to move, I'm gonna put it above my belly. That's going in circles. Yeah, that's going in circles, which means girl. Got it, girl's kicking ass. Yeah, definitely circles. Oh my god, it would be okay. So the ring test says circle. Yeah, it says girl. Okay, so it says girl for the ring test. I still have to do one more, which I will do in like 30 minutes. <laughs> so let me go get my pee and some baking soda. And if it fizzles, it's a boy. If it does nothing, it's a girl. So let's see what it says. So I have my pee, some baking soda. So I'm gonna put like two teaspoons of baking soda in my pee. And we'll see if it fizzes or it doesn't. So. I'm gonna say no. It's not doing anything. So I'm gonna say girl because it's not doing anything. We got so many of these are like yeah. So let's look at the final tally. Should no, it's not fizzing. Um. Okay. Uh, so the final tally. Would be, let me see, give me a second. Here's my phone. Okay, here we go. Okay, so baking soda does nothing, so girl. So that would be. Um, okay, girl. Okay, so it says 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 for the girl and 2 for the boy. Um, so, yeah. So, I will find out in a couple weeks if all these are correct or if they're completely wrong. So, we'll see. Um, yeah. So, we'll see if it's going to be a girl or a boy. Uh, it's going to be exciting. I, once we go to Florida, then we have our anatomy scan, and then we'll find out if it's a girl or boy. Um, but yeah, um, I'm really excited to know. Chris is not going to find out because he doesn't want to, so I'm sure he's going to be in the room with me, and I'll just tell the person doing the scan to like write it down on a paper or something, or have Chris leave the room, and then they'll tell me if it's a girl or a boy. So. Yeah, I'm really excited to see my baby again on the ultrasound.
So I saw it once before, and it was really exciting and magical, and I can't wait. So that's my video for today. Uh, we'll see what it is. <laughs> okay, thank you again so much for watching my video, and please subscribe. Please give me a thumbs up, and if you don't have your notifications turned on, please turn them on. That way, anytime I post a new video, you will get notified. Bye, see you on my next video.